So the novitiate day is, is broken up into a number of sections or parts. Um, the first thing we do in the morning um, is at quarter past seven, we come down for 30 minutes of community meditation where the whole community are together um, in prayer. At the end of that half an hour, we go down to the church and we, we sing morning prayer in the church with the people who have attended the morning mass. Um, after that, we go straight into the conventual mass at, at 8.15. Uh, and after the conventional mass, we come upstairs for breakfast, which is in silence. So there's silence throughout the whole morning until 9.30. After that, the novices have half an hour of house duties. Each novice is given a particular duty in the house. It could be uh, cleaning or in the library or um, uh, doing different jobs around the house, uh, contributing to the community. At 10 o'clock or quarter past 10, then we have two classes with the novices and some of the other priests in the community assist uh, myself in, in teaching the novices in the course of the year. That takes us up uh, to lunch where we have community meal eating together. Uh, sometimes throughout the course of the week we have silence and reading at the table. Sometimes we have just conversation with the brothers. After lunch, we, the novices have two hours of their own recreation time. This is the opportunity to, to leave the priory, uh, to go for walks. Or a lot of the novices use it for exercise. You know, our life can be quite sedentary because we place such an emphasis on study. And so it's important that they have physical exercise as well. And so those two hours are given for that. They come back at quarter past four and they have an hour and a half of personal study where they're again, they're silence in the novitiate. Each brother's in his own room uh, studying and, and the novice master gives them a number of books over the course of the year that they, have, they must read and cover. At 5.30, then we go down for second meditation, which takes us to Vespers at six o'clock. Uh, again, community together, singing the divine office. We come up for our evening meal. And then at seven o'clock, they have a second period of study from seven to quarter past eight. Um, so there's two formal periods of study each day as well as the classes. At quarter past eight, uh, myself and the novices come and say the rosary together, um, which is obviously a great patrimony given to the Dominican order, um, devotion to the rosary. So we say it communally. And then that leads us into the last prayers of the day, which is Compline night prayers of the church. And the community do that at, in the novitiate here at 8.40, which takes us to nine o'clock. And then after nine o'clock, there's solemn silence in the prairie, uh, no talking, each brother goes to his room or some brothers stay up studying, some brothers go to bed early, um, they have that, that, that option. And then we, uh, we give the last words of the day to the Lord and the first words of the next day to the Lord by the opening of the office the next morning, O oh Lord, open my lips. And so really this atmosphere of silence, helping the brothers pray and study together is, is the beautiful rhythm of the day.